The Indian Air Force has initiated collaboration with Dassault Aviation to integrate advanced Indian made weaponry on Rafale fighter jets, specifically the Astra air to air missile. Under this collaboration, the Indian Air Force will take responsibility for the costs associated with integration of Astra Mark 1 missile, while Dassault Aviation will be tasked with developing the essential software codes required for seamless integration, and this integrated solution will be made available free of cost to other Rafale operators. While the Airbus A321-based Netra Mark II program is set to commence developmental trials from 2025 onwards, the DRDO will also take up the Netra Mark III program at a later stage, that will feature a circular rotodome housing and advanced ACE radar system, that will provide a 360-degree angle of coverage, enabling the detection tracking and identification of low-flying aircraft at distances of up to 500 kilometers, and interestingly, the Netra Mark III will also have the capability to engage high-level targets at even greater ranges. According to latest media reports, the Indian Army has started strategic deployment of 30 km range war mate loitering munition, and the Black Hornet Nano Drone. The report also says, that the Indian Army has also acquired the Sabre Sniper Rifle from private sector firm SSS Defense, that is designed for engaging targets up to 1,500 meters and beyond. The Indian Army has also acquired M72 Carbine from SSS Defense, that has a firing rate of 700 rounds per minute. Indian Army troops deployed along the line of control are all set to receive 15,000 bulletproof jackets, 27,000 bulletproof helmets and over 1,400 bulletproof shields from SMPP Private Limited, that will protect them from steel-piercing bullets. The delivery will start in the coming months, and will be completed by end of this year. India has fast-tracked the process to develop indigenous marine gas turbines for the Indian Navy, and reports indicate that Bharat Heavy Electricals Limited and Bharat Forge have been individually consulted for development of indigenous marine gas turbines suited to Indian Navy's requirements, and the Navy has also provided some inputs to aid the development of equipment and spares. Airbus Defence will hand over the first of its 56 C-295 transport aircraft to the Indian Air Force tomorrow, for which the Indian Air Force chief has arrived in Spain, while the formal induction ceremony will take place on 25th September at the Hinden Air Base. The second C-295 aircraft will also be ready for first flight over the next two months, and will be delivered to the Air Force in May 2024. The Indian Air Force has successfully tested the DRDO developed Type 5 heavy drop system from C-17 aircraft, that has the capability to transport and drop arms ammunition and equipment weighing up to 20 tons in the battlefield. It has been built by Airbonics Defense and Space Private Limited, with 100% indigenous resources.